Let us now look at how we can use Herman single factor test to determine whether a dataset suffers from the common method bias issue or not. So in this dataset we have got three latent variables responsiveness which has got five items, reliability which has got again five items and tangibility which has got five items. So in order to test for the presence of common method bias using Herman fact, single factor test, we run exploratory factor analysis. We specify all the observed variables into the model and then in the extraction we constrain the number of factors to be one. Next, in the rotation method, we do not rotate the solution. So we run an exploratory factor analysis by constraining the number of factors to be one and using an unrotated solution. So in this data set, we observe that the maximum variance that is explained by a single factor is 30.75. So approximately 31% of the variance is explained by a single factor. So we can conclude that this data set does not suffer from the common method bias issue because the variance explained by a single factor is less than 50%. In the next video, we will look at how to test for common method bias issue using common latent factor analysis.